There are millions of people living in townships across the continent. For most, this would mean huge business opportunities. But for small businesses, being located more than 30 kilometers away from the biggest city makes remaining in business very difficult. Off the Grid is a venture focusing on the arts. It acts as a pop-up store for art events and music. We play avant-garde jazz music, which is not really different from the basic jazz that we know, the norm jazz. Avant-garde is basically free jazz music that uh, enables us also to express ourselves uh, with the, uh, the emotions and also stuff that affects us in the communities and also with our bringing, including academy. Right now, Off the Grid is struggling to get paying gigs. Despite appearances at the launch of the Long Walk to Freedom, a Nelson Mandela Children's Fund event, and Miss World. Consultants say entrepreneurs like them are often overlooked in the country. Arts is one of the sectors that have been neglected in the market. And the difference with art is that it can only be promoted through uh, media channels. Umzingo fellows who are MBA students from all over the world agree. They are in South Africa to study where the legislation is conducive for entrepreneurship. Yeah. It's a massive uh, sector. Companies are sponsoring a lot. Um, there's lots of energy from uh, lots of entrepreneurs, from NGOs to get things going. Take the plunge and come to Johannesburg because this is the place to be right now. So just go out of your comfort zone and then you can really find uh, an amazing place here in Johannesburg. The founder of Black Like Me, Herman Mashaba, says entrepreneurs should not depend on governments. You know, if, if you want to destroy an economy and destroy a country, get government to really be the driver of economic growth. It has never happened in the history of mankind and it's not, South Africa is not going to be an exception. So if you want to see economic growth in any uh, economic environment in, the, in this day and age, You've got to really allow individuals to be the best they can be. <laughs> but who should be getting involved? I believe that large organizations should strategically partner with local associations in various areas where entrepreneurship is high. And let's say the only thing entrepreneurs in the arts really need is support from both governments and corporates, but also their own communities. Dozo Kumalo, Johannesburg. Know more about your world. ENCA.com